So it would be different for a women's professional athlete in non-combat sports versus the average man. But here's the thing. Megan Rapino would still kick the ass of the average man in a fight. And here's the thing. There are two things all of you seem to be doing and not realizing. One, you're overestimating how big, strong, and athletic the average man actually is. And you're vastly underestimating exactly how athletic elite level women's professional athletes are. Now it is true, Megan Rapino is not a very large person. She's five foot five, 130 pounds. Now I want to remind you at five five, 130 isn't very small, especially considering she's lean, but she's much stronger than probably 99% of 130 pound women. And she's probably stronger than a lot of 130 pound men. Ultimately, the average man is not very strong. They're probably gonna be carrying quite a bit of excess body fat or they're gonna be incredibly skinny and they're gonna have next to no actual cardiovascular conditioning whatsoever. A women's professional soccer player like Megan Rapino is gonna be quite strong for her size. She's gonna be fast and powerful as well. And she's gonna have elite level conditioning because she's a professional soccer player. And this is the point I really, really wanna drive home to all of you. Women's professional athletes are better than men's mediocre athletes, especially at their actual sport. You have USA Women's National Team soccer players and you have them play against your run-of-the-mill average guy at the park, they're gonna beat them in a soccer match. And those average run-of-the-mill guys at the park playing soccer are above average males for the general population. The average male is sitting on his couch watching the game on TV, because he doesn't play sports or train at all. So ultimately, in this scenario of Megan Rapino or really any women's professional soccer player against the average male, I have to go with the woman who probably has better physical athletic traits overall. And here's the thing. Megan Rapino is probably on the small end for even women's professional soccer. There's quite a few women's professional soccer players that are significantly bigger. Some of them will be as big as a lot of the average men, especially if we don't include just their added body fat weight. And you're going to fare even worse against them than you would Rapino. But yeah, I know a lot of you are going to hate this because Megan Rapino is kind of the poster child for why misogynists and homophobes hate women's sports. But Megan Rapino, she could probably kick your ass.